everybody, welcome back to the channel. Today on J-Bob and Sons, I'm opening up something new. It's a new actual subscription box coming out of Jab's family. Now, you guys have seen I've done a video before where I get my Patreon package from uh, Jab's family, and I've opened up that up on the channel. Uh, this is something different, it's something new. So, I kinda wanna share it with you guys, see what everybody thinks. So this is the Jab's family box, all right? Um, the Jabs family box. Uh, so this is a new, this is the December. I, I kind of got hooked by the pack selection, as particularly the 2020 Tops UK. So really cool set. I completely missed out on it this year. Um, I actually had a couple buddies tell me to go on to Tops UK and buy those boxes. I didn't do it. I wish I did. I really want a Mike Trout uh, Tops UK, just base card for the collection, for my collection. And there's many other cool cards. Um, but Bowman Draft uh, update, um, 2020 Optic. I can put a video up here where uh, one of my one of my best performing videos actually is a, a, is 2020 Optic, and I really enjoyed that as well. This year is a really cool release as far as you know Panini Baseball goes. And you guys all know that you know they don't have the the logos, but man, that was a sweet set for sure. So. I don't know, really cool box here. It was $99, I believe, for this box. So first time me getting the Jabs Family box, so I just kind of want to share it with you guys. So make sure you hit the like button, um, hit that subscribe button if you haven't already done so, and uh, go ahead and leave me a comment. Let me know what you think about this box. So we got the packing peanuts, get those out of the way, and let's get to the packs. So a nice pack selection, I think. I'm pretty excited about that tops UK right there for sure. So, all right. So let's rip into this stuff. Hope everybody's uh, having a good day. Um, as you may or as you may or may not have noticed, uh, uh, when you clicked on this video, uh, there are ads now on my videos, which is pretty wild. I'm gonna do a video here real soon. I'm gonna say I'm gonna save the tops UK for last. I'm gonna do a video here real soon, kind of showing you what it took to get to the monetization uh, level through YouTube, which is which was pretty interesting process for sure. Um, but it's something uh, a couple of my viewers asked me to share so I can do that for sure. So uh, let's stop. Let's start with 2020 uh, update series and let's see what we can pull. This is a cool set full of nice short prints. So we'll see what we, if we can get lucky. Uh, so we got Molina. Frazier, and yeah, there's a nice, there's a nice trout, trout pile. All right, a lot of trouts, a lot of Ken Griffey Juniors in this set. Uh, there's Cody Bellinger, we got Martinez, kind of cool Pedro Martinez. Like I said, lots of Mike Trouts, and lots of lots of Mike Trout inserts as well. And then we got the sideways cars, sideways cards, pence. And we do get Jesus Luzardo rookie card. Very well. All right. Next up, let's do archives. Probably not my favorite of the of the lot, but let's check it out. All right. Haven't I've been trying to get a Luis Robert out of this out of this set? Um, there's Reynolds. Haven't gotten lucky yet. Victor Robles, Matthew Boyd, Justin Turner, Pete Alonso. Gold Cup card, and there's a Yadri Molina and Guerrero Jr. to finish it off. So I, I have not been that excited about that set, uh, to be honest. Hey, we got Topps Chrome 2017, which is pretty cool as well. And Bowman Drafts, look at that. That's actually a really cool one too. Um, get the box here. That's Topps Chrome Hobby, that's 2017. So nice one there. Let's see what we can get out of 2020 Heritage Minor League. All right. So this is an interesting Franco Steals the Series card. There's Bryce Ball. Stolen Bases. Nice one there. Gunner Henderson. We got Mason Martin. We've got Gray. Honeywell and Larnick to finish it off. And I don't know if this does the, you know, 
not sure the numbers on the back of the back of those ones if they're short prints or not but you guys let me know uh in the comments down below let's do optic optic was a super fun one this year let us see what we get really cool like a stained glass nice yellow stained glass in the back hey there's trouty <laughs> starting it off with the trout you guys can see there's my mount mike trout rookie card that is the only mike trout rookie card i own by the way um i bought it when it was i bought it a long time ago not that long ago maybe two years ago when i thought that was really expensive for a psa 9 and I, I was balking at the psa 10 prices at the time well all of those cards have gone up exponentially so i Probably should have bought in more than one nine. Yeah. Anyway, kind of funny how cards go. Um, let's see. We got Ramirez. Ooh, now that is a nice looking card. We got the mythical Ronald Acuna Jr. and the Yelich stained glass. Not too shabby there. Now this one is, yeah, nice prism. Ronald Acuna Jr. So, so far, Optic producing my favorite card of the break so far, for sure. Nice one there. All right, next up, let's do, let's do Topps Chrome. I want to do, uh, I'll do draft, then I'll do 17 draft, then 2020 draft, and then we'll, we'll end it with the UK. So here's Topps Chrome Baseball 2017. Let us see what we get. So nice cards for sure. Beautiful cards. Hayward. Hey, there's a Joe Jimenez. Looking like a refractor rookie card. Nice one there. And Rob uh, Zastrinzi. Oh my goodness, destroyed his name there. <laughs> Sorry about that, buddy. And then Carlos Santana to finish off the pack there. So we got some rookies there, but nothing to uh, nothing to get too excited about. So, all right. Let's see what's inside this 2017 pack. So I thought this was pretty cool pack selection. Uh, you know, I've seen a lot of subscription boxes, or, you know, and um, so this is pretty cool. We got a Bowman first of Nick Torres. Nice to get a Bowman first. We got Derek Hill Bowman first. Nice one there. Um, and then how about a Eric uh, Fetty Chrome? And we get, we get maybe two Chrome cards. We get Tyler Nockwin. I'm unfamiliar with Eric Fetty. I don't know if he produced. Uh, Josh Hart. We got uh, Chad Sabotka and a James Ramsey. So not sure if I got anything really great on that one as well. But again, the potential is really nice. So that's why I liked the pack selection. So I just did my my video right before this video, you guys, is uh, an, an entire hobby box of this stuff. Um, you know, you can go watch it and let me know what you think. It's such an interesting set, right? Because so many players, if you don't know who they are, um, it's kind of like a time capsule. And we'll just sort of see what if, if any of these... I'm keeping all my Bowman, right? So we'll just see if some of these guys uh, end up becoming, you know... Uh, oh, I got some color coming. We'll we'll just see if these if the if the guys in the, in this set right produce and become big stars. You never know. You just never know. And so it's kind of an interesting set. So I, I kind of hold on to all of it. So we got Trevor Howard uh, Bowman first. We got the Hankins, Reese Hines, Gilbert, Isaiah Green first, Workman first, Brady McConnell. Jones first, Horn, and Caraway, and Hoffman, and boom! Yes! All right! Nice one there! Are you kidding me? We got the Heston Kierstadt numbered, a numbered top draft pick. You know, I was, I did a whole hobby box of this, you guys, and got shut out. I think I got one paper of him and there you go jabs subscription box nice one there so bowman first heston kierstadt numbered at a 99 kaboom nice one there and then we got the patrick bailey nice one bowman first there we got rutledge and then now we got a nice a couple bowman first chromes 
right? There's Patrick Bailey again. JJ uh, Blade. Zach Daniels, Bowman first. And Aaron Ashby. Nice, man. This is awesome. Very cool. And this is a cool Asa Lacey. So nice Royals card right here. Uh, shout out to Demus on Instagram. If, you, if you're if you watching, buddy, this card's coming to you. If you'd like it, buddy, just let me know. Um, nice one there. So uh, let's finish off the pack. There's a nice J-Dom. Nice one there. Ryan Rutherford. Oh, man. I'm super pumped because I caught basically in uh, L. Alika Williams. Bowman first. Okay, so basically got shut out on Heston Kierstad, uh, you know, from, from an entire box, uh, an entire hobby box, and boom, numbered. I'll take it. I'll take it. All right, last pack, you guys. We got the tops UK. I, all I really want is a Mike Trout base card with the UK emblem on it. So let's see if I can will it into being there. That would be really cool. That will be a card I want to get graded up. Oh, man. Are you kidding me? Kaboom! You guys seeing this? Kyle Lewis at a 90. Oh my goodness. Where, where, where do I start on this pack? Everything's upside down. I start in the front. I start with the banger. I am so confused right now. Let's see what we got. Boom! Nice one there. So we got a Kyle Lewis with Big Ben in the background. Look at that beauty. Oh, man, that is awesome. Nice Kyle Lewis rookie card numbered at a 99. You got the Big Ben there. Come on. That is awesome. And I thought I got Mike Trout. <laughs> it's the Mike Trout fake out always, right? So Matt Dice right there, rookie card. I'll take it. Whoa, yes. Kaboom. Nice one there. Jordan Alvarez, the gold cup. You guys know this is the card I was so excited about when I got into collecting at the beginning of 2020 in top series one was the gold cup Jordan Al Alvarez rookie card. And now here we got it now in a really sweet uh, UK edition. That is a banger. That is another banger. Oh my goodness. Going to be really careful with these. I do want to get these slabbed. So we got Lewis Brinson. Woo, nice one there. Griffith Channing. Nice one. DJ LeMayu, London Series card. Oh, man. JT Realmuto. Buster Posey. Man. Kyle Schwarber. And we're going to end it off with a nice one as well. Shogo. Nice Shogo Akiyama. Rookie card. London edition. You guys. You guys. This box was fantastic. Uh, I'm going to go out and say this was a pretty nice box. I got some really nice UK edition rookie cards, which are essentially short prints, right? And if you guys think about all the tops products that are out there, flagship, not all of them are going to have the UK stamp, right? Kyle Lewis, are you kidding me? Numbered. Heston Kierstad, numbered. I am so pumped. I am so happy I could share this with you guys. Please uh, leave a comment below. Let me know what you think. As always, you guys, stay safe out there. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you on the next one.